Wait, what am I doing? Oh, yeah, mech bay. So I've got a couple of decent mechs. This is, I'm running this Viper with missiles. Now, in the current game setting, the meta, if you want to do most damage, win, have the best outcomes, you basically just run a laser meta, right? Lots of lasers, spamming lasers and heat sinks, and that's how you... Uh, you get through the missions right because you don't have to deal with ammo it's easy to do lots of damage and very pinpoint accuracy so on and so forth but it's not as much fun right you know what's fun missiles missiles and machine guns and auto cannons that's what's fun blowing stuff up being a real tank commander not as uh, effective but i don't really care so we're gonna run this mission we got a kit fox we've got a little ultra auto cannon 10 which is fun we got the Kita with the small laser spam. You know, you got to have at least one. We got another Kit Fox with an Ultra Auto Cannon 10. You double those up, you start messing everybody up. Even though if you run out of little ammo, so what? You figure it out. Um, and if you scan most missions, you'll find some resupplies here and there. And then we got the uh, Adder. I, well, this is the first unlock that I have with it, so I don't. I only have the uh, Prime Mop variant. The two AR PPCs just overheat this thing to nothing, so it's like, why even have the extra one? So instead I opted for the large laser and a little bit of extra armor and another heat sink, so it should be a little more sustainable, sustained damage, and it won't really matter because these four are gonna destroy everything. Um, wait, am I running the cheetah? I thought I was the Viper, okay, sorry. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the, oh, I went with the Viper because Liam has more missile skills it really doesn't matter at this stage because we haven't really upgraded any of that yet and most of the time one little pro tip for you is that you basically want to put all your points into evasion as soon as you can because it will give you a ton of sustain at the later missions so fyi but um i think for this what is this mission i can't remember so i think we're gonna run uh yeah, we're just going to go with the missiles. It'll be fun. Missiles are fun to shoot. All right, let's go. Oh, okay, so we can choose. we got a couple options here. Now, early here, I'm going to basically Star consider... Commander. We have decrypted the oh, intel from the data cores recovered from the killer's abandoned base. We'll see what she has to say. Were they able to provide any valuable intel? Communication logs. We have been able to comb through their records and identified a series of enemy homesteads that could be holding their strategic reserves. You are tasked with investigating each target structure. Data on backup supplies and stockpiles could prove invaluable in finding the hole Valisic is hiding in. Understood, Star Colonel. Aerial surveillance shows a number of light mech elements gathered around these makeshift homesteads. Easy, Hopefully, dude. Let's, we can find let's swat light mechs. Guide us to the pirate's swat them. And force them out into the open. I beat him ah, to death. Star Colonel, we will get the job done. Show them how Smoke Jaguar takes care of business. Head to the mech War crimes? and mount up. Easy. Um, anyway, what I was going to show you, now that we have that, is oh we have a couple options here so we can go with this mission which 175 are they both 175 a oh, 195 see so this one is probably like a mission that we want to do after so we're gonna we're just gonna go in order here so that we're not skipping ahead to where we should maybe have more or heavier mechs um or more variants unlocked we're just gonna go in order here so we don't get ourselves killed and I like where we're at. We're not gonna change our paint job just yet. We're just gonna stick with the old standard. And then we'll pick something cool on the next mission. Stick with me, kids. I know what I'm doing. Jaguar Ops, this is Condor 571, approaching LZ. Roger, Condor 571. No detection by enemy forces. You are cleared to drop. Cobalt has dropped. Nice. There is a good vantage point ahead of you. Nuts on them. There may be activity in the canyon, but you should be able oh, to yes, stay out of sight good. as long as you stay on the cliff. Low profile. Roger. These animations are a little strange, by the way. Like, look how much your mech is going up and down. If you consider that, that's like I don't know, two stories worth of movement. 
if you were strapped into that cockpit, you would be like jello, dude. Like your bones wouldn't last. Maybe if you were in some kind of like hydraulic gyroscopic, uh, you know, cockpit where it's the mech is moving and the thing's staying still. But dude, come on. Let's be a little more realistic with the uh, bouncing up and down. Come on. Like a human body. Just... Is down below. Keep back from the ledge not until they pass. Anyway, nitpicking, but we can't just take them still out weird. now. As Wimmer said in the briefing, minimize engagements until we have tagged the munitions. Oh, okay. Stealth stealth time. Here we go. New hostile detected. Firestar. Oh, I don't want him to see us. New target. They think they smell us. They have spotted us. Oh. Whoops. We don't want to do that. <laughs> My bad. We might just edit that part out. Because I don't make mistakes, really. No, just because it's boring to have to watch this again. Jaguar Ops, this is Condor 571, approaching LZ. Roger, Condor 571. All right, let's get that. We got that point. Cobalt has dropped. I made a point about how bouncing up and down this mech would kill you in real life, but it's kind of fun. I guess. There may be in the canyon, but you should be able to stay but, out of yeah. sight as long as you stay on the cliff. I, if I look Low inside profile. this mech, Roger. I'm not bouncing up, up and down that much. But if I look on the outside, yeah, that pilot's getting just absolutely dead. Dude, you're going up and down. Like a story, two stories at a time. Boom, boom, boom. That's like 25 to 30 feet of elevation in a second. Up and down, up and down, up and down. Dude, nah, come on. Let's let's get her. Let's be a little more realistic here, kids. So as I was saying with this game, as opposed to Merc, it feels a lot more polished. And we can't just take them out now? Not polished in a good way. I mean, like, almost homogenous. A little too clean, like a lab. Right? Like, it's, uh... It's, you know, the whole trash can bashing up against another trash can bucket of bolts. That's the kind of mech I want to be piloting. Now, you can say, well, clan mechs are refined and more sophisticated and better tech. Uh, notwithstanding, I still think the guns and the way the outside impact environment is still I could I, I don't know I just I prefer the uh, the more gritty real battle tech that I grew up with all right like I think we're clear no detection. Right. sweet a little stealth action Cobalt one. So we want to go over Lead there I think the canyon now. there's a river you can follow towards the first base we go that way where do we go different I don't know let's go this way I fly up can I go over this wall? I bet I can. Boom. Just... Oh yeah, I'll go over here. Whoops. Make it to this ledge. Just do a little platforming, a little Mario platforming in a mech. Name of the game here. What if he's got actual food down there? Scan mode engaged. Oh, geez. Something other than deep space travel oh, I cannot. I cannot go this way. Okay, maybe around this Stop. way? You will make me hungry. I can already barely remember food that did not come here. Don't jaguars eat babies? I thought you guys just ate babies, fresh dude. Fruit for destruction too. Oh, this is gonna break my heart. The first munitions depot is just beyond those rocks. Disengaged. Right, Star Commander, so... we may be able to get in undetected by just so the ledge. my team is. Oh, Maybe son of a bitch. That is an option. I guess I'll just have to get a headshot on that dumb blackjack there, huh? Well, I, yeah, I should just make my, I'm pretty sure that wasn't me. That was my dumb team. Yeah, you guys are a little slow on the draw there. Oh well, blackjack's done for, my kids. Target destroyed. Oh shoot. All right. Now, if y'all could just be a little more careful, I would appreciate it. Let's see, where are these guys at? 
Also, I wish I could move the map with my mouse, but it's like like an RTS, you know? But no, you have to use your controls, which is weird, but whatever. Are those guys hunting? Oh, they're coming this way. Hmm. We may want to just pull back from this ledge. Let's let them pass. Here, guys, follow me. We don't want to get caught out. We want to take little damage here. I seem to recall getting wrecked if you don't do that. Copy. Also, it'd be cool to have headlights, I would think, in this. Aye, aye. We're on the just move. in case, I'm going to tell these guys not to Weapons shoot. Offline. Just because I feel like our sensor range is maybe longer than theirs. Here, come up here, guys. Let's not Got be... It. Moving together. I don't want to have to get into a fight if we don't have to. Oh, my next to survive. Oh, did I not send the other ones? Well, maybe I should do my job. Munitions cash confirmed. Scanning for the airstrike team and moving on. Nice. All right, we're, gonna, we're gonna let these these little inner spear crackers pass us. And yes, I can say that I'm part white, dude. Part. Where'd they go? Are we, are we good? Can I, can I, can I go down there now without getting in trouble? Yeah. Well, I don't see anybody. All right, we're just gonna go for it. Lead the way. Go weapon top one. Oh, there they are. Yeah, they're bad. They're gone. Let's go. Let's go. Get out of here. There's a back way into this one too. If we can get up there. Yeah, I'm sure we can. It's just a matter of can you guys not maybe trip the alarm this time? Jeez. Can't count on my team to do anything, dude. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna tell you guys to go sit. Sit it out. Right here. Moving to coordinates. Because Scanning I can't count on you to be responsible. Imagine that. Y'all think the machines are gonna take over Scanning. and they can't even avoid boundaries in video Scanning games yet. Marked for pickup. We haven't taught them how to even do that. They're gonna be making terminators. Please. Weapons cache. Skagwar base. Advise. All right. Hmm. Marking it down as a valid target. These inferior spiroed weapons are of no use to us. Roger. Two to go. Two to go. All right, boys. Follow me. Same as before. We get in and out of here without detection. I see. As long as you guys don't try to follow me, it should be just fine. Oh boy, that's a little, that's a tight space. Oh, it's a tight space. Nice. All right, now I need you. Scanned salvage. I need you silly geese. Just kidding. The pearl of silly silly gooses, silly gooses, as everyone knows. We are on the move. So if you guys could just hang out right there. Stay in your little timeout box. Not screw everything up for me. That would be much appreciated. Alright, let's walk over here and get this going. More munitions. Location tagged. Clearing out. Seems like such a waste. These toys hardly count as weapons, Leo. They're useless to us. Scan loading. Hey, take up your illustrious namesake's post as a con. You can do things differently. What happens if I go that way? Let's find out. Very funny. Cobalt One, give me a Citra. Moving in on the suspected armory now. Hawk One is now airborne. 
They are holding on attack run until Oh, I failed. Your star is prepped to confirm final yeah, target. Yeah, I got to think back to my Doom Eternal Quiaf. skills. Hello. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Actually, wait. Star Commander, these scans. Scanning company are reading life forms. Just one? Okay. There are people locked away in there. Scanning. People? Did you just say people? Let's eat them. Oh, just kidding. Disgusting. Oh, Clan Jaguar cares about people now? Why treat them like it's weird? It's a weird, uh... To Thalasek, that is all they are. He must be trafficking these free for money. Just kidding. Jaguar base. Am I still in scan mode? getting any of this? Oh, whoops. Requesting permission to move these prisoners to a safer location. Come with me, people. Neg. Attempting retrieval now will only put one? their lives in danger. Move to the marked... We cannot just leave them. We cannot just leave them. Do not interrupt oh, we got a social justice warrior over here, kids. Come on, Ezra. Watch you're a clanner, bro. Don't you know we're basically space Nazis? Would be risking their lives and any intel they may have on no, they're not, dude. The clan's actually... Actually, they have a good point. They're like the Native Americans, dude, because it was like their land first. Shut up, bro. Justify war crimes. Go for it. Gender spheres no better. Shut up, bro. All right. <clears throat> Just kidding. Enough uh, inner sphere battle tech politics. Time to kill some people. There's some politics for you. All political power, governmental power comes from the barrel of a gun. Cobalt in position. Hawk one, like you are that. cleared for your attack run. F Cobalt crossing into the AO now. Hawk mm -hmm. one, targeting data sent. Targets confirmed. Commencing attack run. Drop them bombs, baby. Light them up, Hawk one. Yeah, give me that air support. Fortunate Sun starts playing. It should, anyway. Those are pretty weak explosions. Come on. Come on, PGA. That's all you could come up with? Cobalt one. Man, I'll it's weak as hell. Across the board. Draw oh. them away from those prisoners. Brace for contact. Weapons free. What do we think you're doing? Oh, we got a spider. We got a spider, kids. Good. Use that anchor. Keep yourself focused. Let me show you how I use. Show you like a spider. Yeah. Defend this position. Oh, another spider. On the star commander's target. I totally whiffed those missiles. I'm still getting used to this. Ooh, yeah, look at my boys moving in formation. Well, that's pretty awesome. I guess there's a couple of girls in there either, but you know what I mean? Clan boys and girls are basically the same. Dude, that's not even true. Just a sensitivity on this. Maybe you just suck, dude. Mm. Nah, I know what I'm doing. Fifty percent secure this LZ. I'm not gonna tell my team to attack this target. We'll just see how well they. Use their basic instincts. Another one down. Without me having to. Like, I feel like in Mech Warrior Mercs, I had to, like, very much. My team. Kind of seems like that in this one. In this too, but. For the most part. They seem to know how to prioritize targets. Anyway. I don't know. We'll make a comparison at some point. Plus, I think that there being four lance mates instead of three just means that they do more damage in general, so maybe that's, that's something to do with it. 
81%. Here we go. Oh, the close. Oh, there's got it. Of course, there's gonna be one more. New hostile detected. This event might go out of this boundary. They are weakening. Nice. Still in pretty good shape, too. Engaging Star Commander's target. Oh, it's a lot easier to hit when they're not running so fast. Anybody else? Oh boy. Oh. Death Machine Helicarrier. Target. Acquired target. Oh jeez. So call. That's not that's no Igor, baby. Oh jeez. Holy piss. Holy On the Star Commander's target. Oh those missiles are doing some work though, huh? Ah. Jeez. Confirmed. That Secure was no the joke. And hold for I think I the saw some of those in the uh, trailer. Some of Hopefully them they don't. Intel we can use to our have like five of those at a time. That would be a wreck. Almost kill me, son. Of course, they focus fire the commander. Oh yeah, we're in good shape. Look at that. Team, nice, good. We got some XP. Hmm. Perfect. Yeah, nice. Nice. We got some completed research. Cooling, SRM damage. I want more research. SRM heat, ultra auto cannon cooldown. What do we got? What do we got? Ooh, let's go with laser damage. We got, we're going to be running lots of lasers anyway because you can't avoid it. It's the only way to win in this game. Um, cooldown, yes. What else can we do? Sensor range. Heat capacity, that might be a good one to have if we're going to be doing lasers and missiles. Seems like things are a lot more hot in this game. I think mostly just because everything's extended range by default. There's no like standard lasers, intersphere lasers. Kind of nice, but I get it. Clan tech is all about superior, top tier everything. Um. Use time. Yeah, let's go with heat capacity. We want to be on those cooldowns. Oh, we used up a lot of our components. Great. Can I move these around? Oh, nice. Yeah, I want laser damage. Upgrade science lab. I don't have enough points now. I need more components. All right. Let's go back to the barracks. Can we upgrade? I want to save upgrades for evasion. I already have one level of cooldown on the missiles. Energy range. I feel like these go pretty far. Hmm. I'm gonna save for evasion for the next one. And then we'll we'll start building these as we get closer to that. So let's give everybody one more level of evasion. And then we will start upgrading the individual components. I feel like they'll make more of an impact later game anyway. Whereas right now our mechs are kind of just what they are. So 
Maybe I'm wrong for that. I don't know. Let's see what happens. Maybe I'll screw everything up and die. On expert difficulty. I don't care. You can't tell me what to do. Actually, we can. We're the clans. And you're just a peon. Oh, let's do some more... Let's see what kind of uh, Omnipod setups we got here. I like those those missiles. They're doing pretty good for me. What else we got? What was the other one here? Oh, Machine Gun Town. Do we want to go to Machine Gun Town? I feel like that'd be kind of fun. We got some XP. Let's do it. I think this is a decent loadout for now, though. We might just stick with it. I mean, what's my other option here? This is what we have on here currently, right? Also, we went with more lasers, but we're trying to stick... We're trying to go with some missiles, because they're fun. Because it's fun. And I think we're good. I think we've got... I mean, that last battle didn't have a ton of... It was more like a stealth mission, so we didn't have as much fighting, but... I mean, there was enough there was enough ammo to get done what we needed to, so I think that's probably the way to go. What about these guys? Oh, what about... This is what we really need. We want to get some Omnipods for this, because the Prime variant just is a heat suck. Two ERPPC... Oh! Both barrels, baby! There we go. Let's get some fire support. Yeah, hell yeah, brother. Hmm. Oh, that'd be cool. Extra missile. Just double up on all the missiles. Hmm. Right, so we got oh, what? Ultras. Okay, that's cool. Do a little auto cannon. Yeah, the adder's pretty versatile. I guess they all are. See, but like, check this out. Okay, here's one where it's ERPPC or large pulse laser, and this Omnipod doesn't. There's literally no difference between these two, as far as I can tell, because you could just change your ERPPC to a large pulse laser either way, so what is actually changing? Not much. What is this? LRM-15, LRM-15, same thing, LRM-15, LRM-20. This is just heavier. I mean, I could just swap that. In fact, I probably will just swap that for an LRM-15 because them 20s is heavy and it reduces my armor a little bit. So we do have quite a bit of ammo. Hmm. Hmm. Let's actually change these out for ER small ER medium lasers. Get some range because if it's going to run range, it might as well have it, right? And they both weigh one ton, so why not? And you know what we're going to do? We're going to make these 15s, baby. Save a little bit of ammo and a lot of... There we go. We got three tons. <coughs> now it is ten less missiles, but... On small mechs, 30 missiles is going to be enough to do whatever we need. So we're just going to go ahead and add some armor. Armor. Just half a ton. That should be enough, right? We want to keep those arms on because they're literally the entire damage of this mech. Minus the lasers. Um, and then we're going to do a double heat sink. Which brings us to... Oh, 2.4 cooling. Honestly, we may not even need that. Well, let's try it. We'll go take it to the, the old Simpod lab and see how it goes. Instead, we're going to go give you half a ton of armor. And you half a ton of armor. And now we will add 
this is some more ammo. There we go, baby. Another 270 rounds. So now we have one, two, three, four, five tons of LRM ammo. Oh, I have a flamer in the middle. What? What's going on here? That's silly. Well, I'm never going to use that because, you know, distance and all. Let's make that a small laser. Now, we could swap these mediums for small lasers. What's the range on these, anyway? Okay, 600 meters. Like, that's pretty decent. What are these? Mm, seven damage, though. 900. Five heat, though, almost, for every, every time you shoot one of those. It's kind of a lot. How much are the LRMs? Also, about five. Four and a half. Okay. Hmm. Maybe we swap those for small ER smalls and put some more ammo and armor in there. Well, what is that? Just half. That's one more ton, basically. We could do half a ton of armor and another half ammo of missile. But we're going we're gonna to just do this as it is. We're going to go try this out now and see how much... Um, How well this works for us. I'm going to stick my laser here. We're going to have this be our alpha strike. We're going to put these on. Yes. And just for fun, we'll have this as a chain fire so we can shoot those lasers one at a time if things get a little too hot. And now let us go to the sim pod and try it out. Training, shooting range, select. Oh, simulation. Everything's a simulation. This is a re real life is a simulation, dude. There's no way I'm this big in real life. All right. New target. Okay, that's a couple of, that's like quite a few volleys before I, what if we shoot them one at a time? Wow, it takes a lot of missiles. <laughs> of course it is heavy map. Let's try, like, what are we doing with this uh, little, this little baby over here? Oh, see, so yeah. Boom, you kill the locust. You walk around a little bit. Scan mode. Disengaged. You're fine. Everything's fine. Yeah, the cooling could be better. Okay, so you know what? From this distance, though. Actually, can we hit him? Oh, whoops. That's not what I need to do. New oh, detected. I should have been watching there. Lucas. Let's see. Oh, yeah, we can hit him. So it's 300 meters. So, like, if I were here with lasers... <coughs> And these go, what, 600 meters? Yeah, my ER smalls would be doing just fine. Yeah, there we go. Probably we switch those to smalls and get some more... New hostile detected. More ammo in there. But you know what, I think we got enough ammo. This is probably good. We'll just try this out, see what happens. And uh, I think we're probably fine. Abort simulation. All right, let's try this. What's this next one? Oh yeah, we did the the prompt for that. We want to switch back to our Viper. I think these guys are good. These double ultra auto cannon tens are serving us well. I think this Arctic Cheetah laser beam death machine is doing pretty well for us. Let's see. What is our, who's our, is Naomi good with missiles? I mean, she would be if we upgraded them at all. We already gave him, let's give Liam the adder, actually. Because he seems to be doing better with that. Ezra, what's your special power? Okay, this is good. I like this setup. We'll split him up a little bit. Damage, damage, damage. I don't think these guys need to change at all. 
I like what they're doing. Yeah, those UAC-10, not screwing around. How much ammo do I have for that? Two tons? Is that enough? Oh, 120? Yeah, that should be good. Seems like you get a little bit more ammo with the auto cannons in this. The SRM ammo, though, on the other hand, 150 rounds. Not a lot. Hopefully, though, that is uh, just supplementary. Most of the damage should be coming from that Ultra Auto Cannon and sustained from those lasers. I think we're good. This is probably a good setup. If we wanted to, though, what, what could we do with the Kit Fox if we unlocked a couple Omnipods? Your Medium Goss. I mean, that's basically what we have now. Wouldn't change too much. Am four AMS ammo? Like, do I need that much AMS ammo? Oh, three AMSs. Okay. I see. This is like, I really, I'm missile phobic. I really don't want to get shot with missiles. That's kind of cool. There might be a utility for that in some mission. Um, oh, here we go. Another long range fire support mech we could build. Hmm. Oh, but it literally just has LRMs. There's like nothing else. We have to stack some more ammo in there. And an LRM-5 too. This is like all out not screwing around large pulse pulse lasers and a streak SRM4 or the kill fox I like the kill fox man we're just gonna stick with that I'm pretty I'm pretty stoked with it this is a good setup all right let's get out of here let's go kill some more people and we'll call it a day what are we, who are we killing all right this one cool we identified the series of home Enemy homesteads based on decryption intel recovered from the abandoned killer's base. Investigate each target structure for backup data and resource stockpiles that may reveal the hole's location. Coward, blah, blah, blah. Kill, kill, kill. Got it. Kill everyone, do war crimes, etc. I think we've got the right team for that. Let's go. We've got a little versatility. We've got that mid range. we got my brawling death machine up front. And then we got some fire support. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. Jaguar base. This is Condor 097. We got that we striker with 70 yard small lasers. Everyone has a role. Copy Condor 097. You are clear to deploy mech assets into the LZ when ready. Jaguar base, we have touched down at the LZ. I feel like if we just gave everybody the same mech commander. and did the same thing though and just stack yeah. damage. Advancing to the first I can't help but think that would just be like the best way to do this, but it's about optimal perfect min max every time sometimes it's just about having a good time a little bit of everything trying to pretend and play mech commander because you can wait did i see something up here trying to hide from me son Jumps that sound pretty cool though, now that I'm thinking about it. I have eyes on static sentries and oh. up in defensive positions. It sounds like an actual like, Weapons free. SpaceX rocket taken off. Destroyed. Which it should, because you know, we're moving an office building here. With guns on it. Alright. I'm being all safe and careful. Now what could be cool here is if there was a if there were like mechs and stuff here, you could say Oh, there are. Sweet. Oh, nice. Shoot those rocks. That's what I want to do. Uh, what if we set our people up here, and then we take our striker with us? Who's in the striker? Ezra? On your coordinates. And... New hostile detected. Wait. Oh, he just walked right up to us. Kind of makes it easy then, doesn't it? But we're going to go ahead and... Stick with that. Oh, is that Gabriel, son of the Primarch? All right, back to business here. Lighting up, please. Oh, we got a Phoenix Hawk. 
cool thing about Phoenix Hawks is you just blow their arms off. They don't have any guns. Oh, what do you do now, tough guy? Bash into that, bash into this. Mm. Elementals will handle the cleanup. We need to hit those other targets before the killers become aware of your presence. Yeah, do we? Copy Jaguar base. I feel Moving like we're on. doing okay here. I feel like we don't need to do anything. Liam's all beat up though. Santander will be free in no time. Your head is going to get too big for your new Maybe we should send Liam like right here. What do you think, Naomi? Kidding. You think one of us is kidding. a future L star? Oh jeez. None of you are dead yet. Oh that my gosh, that fleet just got annihilated. Cool. Alright, let's do let's let's play tactical. Let's do a little battle commander here, okay? Um Alright, so if I were if this is like there's probably a bunch of mechs here, if I put Liam like right up here, he's just gonna be absolutely dropping bombs on people. So let's see what happens if I oh no, can't put him there. Oh, oh, where 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 he, he did that get, uh, hmm. Let's see what happens if we do that. And back to business. All right. <coughs> we'll put him on the patrol. In range of storehouse Bravo. More hostiles dug in. Do I smoke them out? This is a glorified training exercise. You're fighting a loose battle. Yeah, well. You oh, piss. Spider. Oh. Oh, jeez. Oh, those flames. Those are flames are not screwing around at all. You think he's a good. Alright, guys. Yeah, take out that arm. You know. Oh, well done. That worked out pretty well. Oh, except for Liam changed. As soon as I told him to attack other targets, he changed his uh, directions. Let's see if I can get him to go up here. This is probably where I'd want it. It's like right here. All right? If I had a, a bunch of LRMs, I'd be, want to be right here. It's like... Oh, just kidding. What is he? F4, F4. Oh, it, uh, oh man, I'm retarded. Rolling out. <clears throat> Meanwhile, our entire lance is dead by the time I've been able to issue a single command. Just kidding. My guys are absolutely wrecking nuts up here. Oh. Oh. Can't yeah, things flying over us? Okay. Okay, so we're supposed to go over here. Got it. Once again, is there... Is this going to provide me any kind of like overview? Oh, yeah. Okay. So, um, first I have to stop moving my mech. Then I have to get back in here and tell everybody to go, or Liam at least. We want him. Uh, we want him up in an elevated position. And we're going to see how well that goes for us. All right. Liam now has an elevated position. A lance of killers are masked up in defensive positions. Punch There's through. a tank over there. Ah. Scan mode engaged. Oh, should I kill that tank? Scan mode disengaged. Affirmative. We are moving in. Oops. Let's kill this tank. New target. Our attempt to be clever and tactical is just kind of folly. Maybe we should just get back to killing. Later. Retards. Oh, were there things? Were there things I could have picked up? You know how much I love looting and plunder. It's a little bit less satisfying in this because it's just like parts that you can use to upgrade, but it's got its own kind of fun to it, I guess. Hmm. Nope, I don't see anything. Scan mode. Disengaged. Engaged. Okay, cool. Well, back to business, everybody. We are moving along. We want to take up an elevated position. Isn't that what we said, right? F5, 
Wait, Liam. Liam, you're F4. Here you are. Go right here. Go right there. Okay. And the rest of us. Wait, where are we going? Did we already go here? Oh, this is where we're going. Actually, I don't know. What has happened? Oh, I ran into a wall. Nice. Okay. Issuing commands is a waste of time. Just kidding. It's probably good. I just need to figure it out. All right. We're going to take elevated positions up here. Oh, nice. Okay. Falling in slow motion, just like original, whatever. Reforming on you. Yeah, just... Everyone just come up here. I don't know. Like, the whole tactical overview thing still isn't making sense, but... Oh, see, there's scan something I can scan. Engaged. Scan mode disengaged. Okay, here's what we're going to do. Liam, you go here. Moving. And the rest of us are going to go down here. And it's all going to work out. Now we have Overwatch. That's what we call Overwatch. Oh, nice. Loot. There we go. Liam, how you doing up there, buddy? Have you, have you managed to make it? to the place that I told you to go? Down to or is it gonna take you as much time to get there as it would just to, like, eliminate our enemies? And making the entire moving people around in a tactical way a waste of time. And a mechanic that's useless. I don't know. Let's see how it goes. Destroyed. Is it working? They are down. Okay, so that's... Yeah, Liam's in the adder. Ha still hasn't managed to go to the uh, Incoming, place that I told him to. Seems kind of pointless to even have that then, right? Or maybe because he doesn't have jump chests, he can't get up there. But he didn't tell me that, so I, I have to assume that he just isn't listening. Nice. All right. Uh, Everybody just in. follow me. Whatever. Try to issue commands. You try to play the game in a cool way. It's a waste of time. Just give up and kill everyone, dude. I'm gonna take it out on my enemies. Nice. I asked for him, so I'm go that far. I am figuring it out. Destroyed. Scan mode engaged. Anything else I can take? One more things. Give me things. Nope. All right. What are we doing? Where do I go now? Eliminate killers at Storehouse Charlie. Where is... Am I at Storehouse Charlie? Is that where I am? I feel like that's where I am. I feel like I've killed everything that moves. Is there, is there more to kill that I didn't realize? There's probably like one turret just hanging out that everybody missed, right? No? This storehouse, Charlie. Uh, okay. Hello, game. I'm pretty sure all of our enemies are dead. Do we kill them too quickly for you to process what to do next? Is this game ridiculous? Have they finished making it? Oh, oh, I saw someone. On your target. Oh, he's like stuck up there. What? What's going on? Well, oh, okay, he's like stuck. All right, whatever. Let's go blast him. Let's go get that rear armor. Yeah, see you later, idiot. Okay. How much longer do you think they can hold out? Between the dropships they blew up, the base they abandoned. And all the material they're losing here, the killers must be running on fumes. Yeah, highly likely they are only going to get more desperate as things drag on. They can feel sentient or slipping through their fingers. Just do not allow overconfidence to seep in. That could get you killed. <coughs> Oh, nice. Liam's doing stuff. This is 
LRMs are coming in handy. I don't know if you needed an entire volley for a single VTOL, but whatever. All right, can we walk up? Let's have him come up here. Gosh, the amount of slow motion and the falling. Uh, like, give me a break. Okay, this seems like... Can I get up there without jump chats or no? Okay, maybe we should have thought. Oh, we'll use. Okay, let's try this. Oh, just kidding. All right, never mind. Can anybody follow me? Oh, everybody's here. Haha. <laughs> they listened. I feel good about that. Okay, how about here? With you. Whoops. Oh, frickin' A. Oh, jeez. It's a hatchet man. Don't let him touch us. He's coming to touch me. Kill that guy. I'm gonna distract him. Oh, never mind. He's dead. Alright. Well, so much for distraction. Is there any things? I want things. I want things. I want money and loot. That's all I care about. My mercenary roots will never change. Where's this guy going? Yeah. Target area secure. There we go. Good. Only one storehouse remains to be cleared out. Nice. We will see it done. Did that mech just try to attack us with a stick? The Dragoon reports called that one a uh, hatchet man. Supposedly, it is hmm. one of the first new mechs manufactured by the Inner Sphere in centuries. It took them centuries to graft a stick onto a mech? How bad have things gotten out here? Bro, give me that mech, I'll knock Pretty you bad. out. This give me that hatchet man, dude. I'll show you what, I'll show you what it means. Mechs together from Teach you about the Inner Sphere. Other mechs. Put it up your anus. To think that Clan Wolf wanted us to stand by and do nothing? Cowards. Yeah, well, if I had Commander Mason here, dude, if I got Commander Mason on the field, you guys would be screwed. Five of you, ten of you, twenty of you, bring any of my any of my campaigns into this. Absolutely destroy your life. Oh well, that'd be cool. If, like your when Commander Mason shows up in one of these battles, and you have to fight your old your old. Uh, Merc company, you get absolutely wrecked because you can't customize any of your mechs. New target. Yeah, that range is pretty good for these lasers, though, right? Even the smalls. <clears throat> Clan tech has its advantages. Not on the low ground, though. Okay, let's let's do a little analysis of where we're at here. So there's probably a fight inside of this place. We can just assume there's a fight in there. Okay, Liam, do you think you could walk? Like I don't know any. Nope, 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 nope. Okay, how about there? Let's try that. Uh, no. Did I press the wrong button? Attack move two. Okay, cool, got it rest of us are gonna go see and I could have just issued that Pushing command that hard. so much for token resistance scan mode engaged scan mode disengaged new hostile detected raven Ooh, raven huh they getting creative up in here Let's see if we can put you up here. All 
Oh, yes! They actually worked. Scout those things. I want them. Mm hmm. Oh, hello. Corsair. Oh boy, the pirates have become upset. The name of Corinthian is that thing. No idea. Aim for the head, kids. You'll be fine. Back with the LRMs, I worked out. Hold on station till we lost the Arctic Cheetah, over. but you know, he didn't really stand a chance. Let's Start be honest. Matter. Let's get a scan of that Corsair. I have a hunch we'll find something good buried in his staff. Disengaged. Plan on tinkering with whatever we find? That can't hurt. These pirates have been full of surprises so far. I prefer to be ready for the next one. Scan mode okay. disengaged. Scan mode engaged. Scan, Scan complete. Liam, did we get everything you need? Yeah. The killer seemed intent on hiding this one away. We'll be good to pry into why. Scan mode engaged. Nice. Okay, well. You guys got wrecked, but that's okay. Wait, did he? Oh, he must have got a headshot. 82%. Yeah. Must have headshot him. Can our pilots die? That'd be awesome. At least get replaced with some rando. With clan tats and everything. Okay. 74, 42. We probably need those. Let's clear that. And max this out. Actually, we'll do like 160 and we'll get the rest here. Max. Boom. Seems good. Sweet. The food is not any better. I know. They lied to me too. What are we supposed to do? Allahu Akbar. Oh, wait. I cannot believe our march on Terra has finally begun. Why? Was this not what we were made for? That is funny, oh, coming from someone thing. who was still gestating in an iron womb when most of the clan to man was being blooded in battle. The Zakan said it herself. Generations of warriors have come and gone, all believing themselves to be the ones to herald our return home to the inner sphere. When I was a Sivkin, people spoke of the Dragoon Compromise. How the intelligence gathered by Wolf's Dragoons oh, we got to the, the wise woman telling us what to do, us dumb old white came. men. We don't know anything. For nearly 40 years, the clans received intel oh, from the Dragoons. Oh, great, great. And yet, hey, we're going. it's happening in real life, too.